and stealth My motive be what's most important to me You see, I can't stand to see us live unfortunately Whether suited up or in peace, sporting a team If you black, they'll close the doors and try to blow up the keys So indeed, I'm here to proceed and supply what you need So will we be learning about all of this war stuff going on around the world? Even though it's not happening in the U.S., the tax dollars from Americans are... So right now, what is Pablo wearing? Pablo's wearing a hoodie. So be gone. He got a nice Under Armour hoodie. Nice. And at the same time, teaching them too. Drug, sex, and breaking necks. Who's next to flex? Your way you get all that pain. BX, BX. Yo, why you think them shorties bang? A check, respect, because of neglect. They upset, so they rep the set. Me, that is verbal assault, and now my flow is a felony. Cause liver, li liver, lyrically, check it. Liver, li Buenos dias, Kevin. Como estas? Buenos dias, mi maestro. El Professor Flex. What's all of these words we're learning today? Today, we're taking our last few steps before starting our first official assessment or examination. These are the new vocabulary words, or las palabras del vocabulario nuevo. For starters, we have las preguntas, or the questions. Como means how. Que means what. Por qué means why. Quién means who. Donde means where. And cuando means when. That's what I'm talking about. Being able to ask questions is a big step. I'm going to practice these todos los días. But hey, how can we say los for some words, but las for other words? Excellent to hear and phenomenal question. Los and las are the plural versions of el and la. El means the for masculine words and la means the for feminine words. Los is the plural version of el and las is the plural version of la. Okay, I, I, I kind of get it, but I thought el means he when conjugating verbs. Now you're on a roll with your thinking cap. El with an accent means he. El without the accent means the. Long story short, for most nouns and adjectives, you will need to focus on how it ends. For words that end with an e or O's or S, it is usually masculine, and for words ending with an A or AS, it is usually feminine. Check out the new vocabulary words, la casa and el parque. Casa ends with an A and is feminine, so la is used to say the house. Parque ends with an E, so L is used to say the park. Okay, that definitely makes sense now. Casa just means house, but to say the house, la casa is used because it's feminine. But if E or O are masculine, how is it a la before clase? Well, these are a few words that ends with a masculine letter, but are still feminine and vice versa. Think about your greetings. Good morning is bueno dia. Good afternoon is buena tarde, and good night is buena noche. These are irregular from the norm, but must be memorized and recognized as rare. That completely adds up now. It's similar to learning irregular verb conjugations. And I thought contento meant happy. Is feliz a different type of happy, similar to how estar and ser both mean to be? Not exactly. Contento means that you're okay. Content with things are happy regardless. Think of contento as being gratefully happy. Feliz is the type of happy you are when you're celebrating. Oh, like Feliz Navidad or Feliz Cumpleaños. Si, esto or eso. Wait up, how are these O words neutral but the E's are masculine? Well, when saying this or that in Spanish, you have to understand what is in reference. In other words, if you're making a general statement about something that is unknown, you would use the neutral form for this or that. If you're referring to something that is already known, 
you use este or ese if it's masculine for this or that. And you use esta or esa if it's feminine for this or that. If you want to say the plural versions of this or that, you say these or those. Estos, estes, and estas means these. Esos, eses, and esas mean those. Let me try. These are a lot of words. Estas son mucho palabras. Great try, but mucho has to be feminine and plural as well. So, estas son muchas palabras. Excelente. Don't forget to do your tarea and review all of your notes. Good job. Back to my point. Since 10,000 BCE, the Moors are historically documented with being present in South America and North America, which was called Turtle Island. They spread and settled all over both continents. And for those in the North, they made hubs in certain regions to store and maintain harvest for the long winter months. One of those main hubs is in the Black Hills of South Dakota. The same area where this precious mother Mount Rushmore is. Long story short, this hub in South Dakota was referred to as the Sixth Grandfather's Mountain and was used by tribes all over the region. Even those with beef knew not the f on at the Sixth Grandfather's Mountains. Real sh And we got bloods, crips, woos, chos who can't even stop killing each other after they made it. Bang, bang. <laughs> Struggled, went to jail, came home, got a rap bill, and still end up doing dumb street sh for the gram. Yeah. But when the U.S. started expanding its regions, initially they gave the natives the rights to their sacred land. And then there was a rumor of gold being present in the region and pobrecito. Next thing you know, <laughs> the U.S. went against its own word and stole the land back from the natives. And still, my motive be what's most important to me. You see, I can't stand to see us live unfortunately. Whether suited up or in peace, sporting a team. If you black, they'll close the doors and try to blow up the keys. So indeed, I'm here to proceed and supply what you need. So will we be learning about all of this war stuff going on around the world? Even though it's not happening in the U.S., the tax dollars from Americans are... So right now, what is Pablo wearing? Pablo's wearing a hoodie. So we gonna, he got a nice Under Armour hoodie, nice. And at the same time teaching them too. Drugs, sex, and breaking necks. Who's next to flex? Yo, where you get all that pain? BX, BX, yo, why you think them shorties bang? A check, respect, cause of neglect. They upset, so they rep the set. Me, that is verbal assault, and now my flow is a felony. Cause lyra, lyra, lyrically, check it. Lyra, 